Hi guys and welcome back to video number two of the beginner pole dance series. My name is Molly Pretzel and this is my living room. I don't know why I said that. Uh, obviously it's not a pole studio, it's my living room. Anyway, I will be teaching you here. <laughs> so uh, today we're going to do three basic sits on the pole. We're going to do it in static, that means that the pole is standing still. If you didn't see the video yesterday, static is pole standing still, spin is when the pole is spinning around. The first sit we're gonna do, we're gonna use our lats to pull first, Boop. so pull down, and we're gonna do a half braided grip. A half braided grip means that we are pulling, we are having our knuckles on one side, our elbow on the other side, so we have our arm diagonal, this arm is pushing the pole. So we need to be pulling and pushing. So this is our basic position. Now I want to take up the same leg as my upper hand. I'm going to place the furthest part of my thigh on the pole. You can have your leg straps or bend however you feel like here in the beginning. So pull, push, place your leg. The other one is going to come under. You're going to squeeze your legs together all that you can, cross them over. From here you're going to push this part of your body forward and then you're going to be able to sit. I call this a long sit. If you want to advance it, move down your hand and come out even further. What might happen when you do this is that you go out and you start turning. Don't be afraid of this, it's very normal. So when we do any sit on the pole, actually any trick on the pole, what will happen is that our skin is gonna get like squeezed to the pole, so it might feel like you're sliding down. So what happens is that I'm gonna put my thigh on, here I'm not gonna stick, but if I squeeze it up into the pole, my skin is gonna get all roughed up. This is when I stick. So, pull, push, take your leg up, other leg up, from here I twist my hip, bing! I take my chest forward, put my shoulder blades together, push forward, and I sit here. Make sure to point your toes, extend your knees, so this will not happen. This is not beautiful, so go here and feel pretty. Sit number two is my favorite sit. I call it the hip sit because I didn't know any better. And just so you know, like all of the tricks in pole dance, have a million of different names and my names might not be the right one. As long as you do the pose and you use the technique, you're gonna be fine. Name is not that important in my opinion. So, you're gonna do the same, pull and push. From here, I'm gonna place the pull into my hip and I'm gonna just twist like doing a small booty pop. So I wanna be here, booty pop, take the other leg down, I have it around my knee and this is a hip sit. You can lock your leg if you want to and lock the other one and then you might actually be able to let go. Look how I'm leaning into my hip to make it putting my weight forward and this will make me stick better. So just once again, pull, push, place your hip in. Here, take the other leg in. You can hook around. I also feel the pull a little bit in my belly skin. Don't squeeze it too much though. Bend and be here and look beautiful. It's time for sit number three. It's actually kind of similar to sit number one. You just have your legs a little bit higher and you need a little bit of flexibility uh, in your legs in order to do it and make it look pretty. If you're not flexible at all, don't worry. Just give it a try and as soon as you get flexible enough, it's gonna be easy peasy. I will also make some flexibility videos for beginner if you feel like I have no clue what to do. Anyway, sit number three. Pull, push. From here, same thing. Place your legs up and come under. Now make sure to take your hand down. Make sure to push your chest forward. Lift up your legs and sit here. I call this the martini sit. I'm not sure it's the right name. Come back down again. Make sure to squeeze tightly and pull back. If you don't do that, you might get a skill hook in the anus and hook into your vagina or man part and it hurts. So make sure and squeeze together, lift up. I'm gonna show you one more time. 
pull, push, come in here like you did before, so a little bit dirt with your hip, hands down, and sit in the martini sit. Take in and come down from the pole. All of these basic sits can be done in spin pole as well. So if you feel like this is easy for you and you want to make it harder, then try to put spin on your pole and go around. I will also make a video later with how to control the spin and how to come into the spin pole. So if you didn't subscribe yet, do it now so you will get a notification when I make a new video. I will see you tomorrow for day 3 of the beginner pole dance video series. Bye!